Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you are new, welcome to my channel. My name is Lindsay, and I'm currently 17 and a half weeks pregnant with a little baby girl. If you are new here, please hit that subscribe button down below before you forget, and also hit that like button. I do a lot of pregnancy content, a lot of haul content. I am trying to get back into vlogging. It's kind of hard because I have a full-time job that is not out of my home anymore. But, like I said, hit that subscribe button. Today I will be talking about my first Mother's Day experience, what I did, what I gave to my mother and my mother-in-law, what I got, everything like that. So if you're interested in that, let's get into the video. I just want to start out this video by saying that none of this is bragging. This video is not intended to brag and it is not, this day is not about like materialistic things. I remember when I was a kid, I used to take my mom a bowl of cereal when I <laughs> didn't know how to cook or anything on Mother's Day. So service is definitely a way to serve your mom on Mother's Day. So this is not meant to brag. It's just so that I can remember what happened, what I did, everything, and to show you guys what I got, maybe give you guys some ideas for your mom's birthday, maybe. So I just wanted to start out the video like that. Also, I'm going to try to link as many as of the things that I can find down below and I will put like what it is and then the link so that if you want to get it as well, you are able to. So, go check the description box if you like any of these things and want to get them for yourself. So, I want to start out with what I gave. Um, first of all, my mom lives across the country so I wasn't able to see her on, on Mother's Day. So, uh, my husband and I sent her a box of bath bombs. Here, I'll put a picture right here. But she, when I was a kid, used to take a bath almost every day. I don't know if she still does or not. But bath bombs make every bath better. I don't care who you are. They just make it fun and they make you feel good and smell good and everything. So, that's what I got my mom. And what we got from my mother-in-law is this green, army green shirt. I'll put a picture right here again. And it says, togetherness is the best above all the other rest. And that is like an inside joke about a shirt that my mother-in-law used to have. So we just had one of my friends that has a Cricut machine and um, she does vinyl. So like the heat press and everything. We had her custom do that shirt for her. And we got the army green because she really likes army green. But that is what I we gave. Cody and I what we gave our mothers and they both really liked it so that is awesome bath bombs and inside jokes never fail everyone so I want to start out by saying also I don't really care if you believe that this is my first Mother's Day or not I decided to celebrate because I'm pregnant and I wanted to so I decided to celebrate and obviously the baby's not here yet, so I got a lot of baby stuff, which I absolutely adore. I would almost rather get stuff for her than me because it's just so cute. But I wanted to start out by showing you guys what Cody got me. It came on this little card. It says, to my mommy, I may just be a bump, but I love you more than you'll ever know. Keep this close to your heart until I can meet you and rest in your arms. Loves and kisses and kicks from your tummy. And this necklace came on it. It's little feet, rose gold feet, and a little heart inside a heart, which is really cute. I haven't taken it off. I just took it off to show you guys, but I have worn it every single day since I got it because I think it's just so cute and I love it and I needed a new necklace. So thank you Cody for that necklace. I just absolutely love it. Next up, I have something from Cody's grandma. Um, she got me this little outfit. It's three month old size. It has little bows. And then the headband has a little black bow on it to match. It is so cute. It has little black flowers. It's just a really cute little outfit. And she also got me this one chime. It has bees on all the sides. So cute, it will go really well on my porch. And then Cody's aunt got me this cup that says Mom Established 2022. It currently has my crystal light in it, but I love it. Really cute, really practical. 
Thank you so much, you guys. I was not expecting to get anything from you guys, but it made my day. So, Cody's mom got us a few things. This is for me and the baby. First of all, she got her these cute little dinosaur pants with a ruffle butt with this matching shirt. It says, Cutosaurus. It's so cute. And I can't wait to put her in it. It is a size six to nine months, so she will be a little bit bigger when she wears that, but I just can't wait. I love dinosaurs. If you don't know me personally, I love dinosaurs. I took a class in college about dinosaurs. I just think they're so interesting. And like for Cody and I's first wedding anniversary, we went to a dinosaur museum in Utah, St. George, Utah. And um, it has like, it's built on this farm ground where dinosaur, like they actually have dinosaur fossils in the ground right there, like you can see. Super, super cool. But she also got us this cactus crib sheet. It's like watercolor kind of. It's super pretty. I don't want to take it out of the package because I know I would not fold it up this nice. And then this is a crib, crib skirt with little pom-poms. It's just white. I'm trying to show you the pom-poms. I'm not taking that out either because I don't think I'd be able to get it all wrapped up nice again. And it stores better like that. She also got us this little mobile. It has pink cactus on it. With, and a little wooden one in the middle, but it has little bells. It's so cute. I think it's just adorable. And I just can't wait to set up her nursery. We're getting our crib here in the next few weeks, so I will definitely show you guys setting that up and decorating her little corner. Like, if you haven't been following me for that long, we are gonna put her in the corner of our bedroom for the first year or so. Um, but yeah. That's all that she got for baby. And then she got me this little gold pineapple fake plant. I think it's so cute. It's gonna go in our guest bathroom as a decoration. And then she also got me a um, Amazon, or no, Target gift card. So I actually got myself this shirt from Target cause I am outgrowing all my t-shirts. This is a Rolling Stone shirt. And then I also got this Rolling Stone shirt from the men's section, I absolutely love big t-shirts and they're so comfortable right now. I am uncomfortable in a lot of my old t-shirts, they're too small. But I also got a few like practical things that <laughs> we just needed. So uh, Cody and I's second wedding anniversary is tomorrow. So I got him this quick buff beard scrub to help his beard grow in a little bit thicker. I heard that this would help and we just used the same cleanser and moisturizer. So I got him this for our anniversary. It smells really good, it smells like mint. And I also needed some more conditioner. I've never tried this one. Let me know if you like it or not. I just, I have a lot of hair so I need to use a lot of conditioner and I just find myself going through small bottles of conditioner because I have curl in my hair so I need the hydration but if I get a little bottle of curl shampoo or curl conditioner it costs a lot more and I don't have that much money to be spending like 10 to 15 dollars on a little tiny bottle of conditioner when I go through it in like three weeks so hopefully this is good hopefully it smells good I haven't smelled it at all but I, it has coconuts on the front so hopefully it smells like coconuts I love coconuts and the last thing that we got at Target is Cody got some um, antacids. He goes through these things like candy. He has major heartburn. So I ended up picking some up because they had the big kind and he likes the wintergreen mint flavor. And they never have that flavor at Walmart or hardly ever at Target. So when we saw these, we were like, okay, we're gonna grab these and we're gonna snag them while we can. But, that is all that I got. I got a few cards in the mail, which thank you guys for everything. Thank you to Chris for all the baby stuff and everything that you got me as well. But I got a few cards in the mail. Um, I was really bad. I don't know why I did not do any cards for Mother's Day. I just, I blanked, I guess. I'll blame that on the pregnancy brain or something. <laughs> but 
yeah, I really love everything that I got and obviously the things that I picked out for myself. So thank you again. I really appreciate all of you and I hope that everyone had a good Mother's Day and I hope that you got to spend the whole day with your mom and I know that not everybody has a good relationship with their mom so I'm sorry if you don't. I'm sorry if you've lost your mom. Anything like that. People that have lost babies, I feel really, you, I feel for you. But I just hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a like and please subscribe if you didn't at the beginning of the video so you don't miss any more of my content. And I will see you in the next video.